Reverend Timothy To, good evening. We are happy to have a short interview with you this evening. We are I'm very honored. Praise the Lord. What do you think about the ministry of the Bible College, such as Far Eastern Bible College, where you are the principal? We are very happy for God raising up Dr. Jeffrey Ku, yes. who is my successor according to my wish. Praise the Lord. What advice do you have for those who are teaching God's Word in the school? You should know the Bible, that's all. Well, if they are zealous for God's name and God is number one, that's right. They are nothing. So all the young men who serve God must remember God is everything. All glory must be to Him. Yeah. Wonderful. Well, there is no compromise. If they put God first and God is seen as the number one, as the one that must be obeyed. It will be all right. Okay. How would you summarize the work that the Lord has given to you? I don't think I can regard myself as anybody. But we just have to serve the Lord. Yes. Faithfully. Amen. Well, we just now heard that God willing, Dr. Jeffrey Koo should carry on the work that you have begun in Far Eastern Bible College. We thank God for a faithful man in Dr. Jeffrey Koo. Now people have come by God's grace from Africa, Australia, and other parts of the world. When you see this, do you feel great joy in the Lord? Of course, I feel a great, great joy still. Yes. That we are needed in Africa. Yes. Well, praise God for that. Brother Jeffrey Koo has gone to Kenya and he'll be visiting Tanzania also where our church is in Singapore, uh, True Life, BP Church, has sent money to support the building of the Bible College. And what Interestingly, not True Life as much. Unknown ladies Unknown ladies. Yeah, you do not know. Praise the Lord. Have sent the money. It's amazing how the Lord provides. Yeah. Reverend Thor, I always remember you used to say, self-help with God's help is the best help. Well, I hope I'm correct. <laughs> That's right. You are absolutely correct. Now, sometimes we find ourselves without any strength to help ourselves. Even in the ministry. But as you say, here and there God raises people whom we do not know. And they send in money. That's right. Self-help... With God's help is the best help. Amen. 
<laughs> it is a restatement of Matthew 6.33. Seek ye first the kingdom of God yeah. and his righteousness, and all these right. things shall be added unto you. Well, right now you are going through some sickness because of old age. How do you keep yourself strong in the spirit? By one word that I have discovered, he makes us to live and not to die. So I have absolute faith in God that he will restore me. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Truly, even a young person like me, it's a great lesson to learn. God has made us to live and not to die. So until the Lord calls us home, we persevere through all our difficulties. Yes. Praise the Lord. Thank you for teaching me and also officiating my marriage with Caroline. <laughs> you are my pastor in that regard. I said that you are my grandson. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we remember that all the time. But that privilege of serving with you is something that I'm thankful to God. I remember the encouragement to the people. When you go to the city and looking for a car park, you often don't pray. But when you find one, you must praise the Lord twice. Twice. <laughs> yes. I, I say the same thing to my people. I said, I learned it from you. you. Must praise the Lord twice. Yeah. We forget to pray. And when the Lord gives us a place, yes. we must say praise the Lord twice. That's right. 